What's going on guys, Coach Stoneface here, and today we are going to do a mini tin opening. We got a box here, the five pack of mini tins. Uh, I believe these are Canto mini tins. Paul, I just want to make sure my camera is working. I have been having some camera issues today, so we're going to give this one a shot and hope for the best. Now, I have done my research on these. I know they aren't going to be fantastic, but what we are going to get is we do have five cards up top. We have five tins, two packs per tin. Uh, my understanding is they are quite old packs and a medallion per tin. Now, we're going to open these, this box up here, and it's not going to be an easy box to open. So I apologize for doing this off camera. I didn't realize it would be so difficult. All right, I don't know if I just hit that or not, but we'll go like this. So here we have our pack. Now... I believe there is, so these ones are the C, there's C's and then I believe there's KL's and they have different packs inside of them. So we can see on the bottom here, if I can get it to focus, right on the side it says C20. Um, so I believe there is KL ones which have better packs, but these are C20, C20, C20. I'm guessing they're all gonna say C20, they do. So we'll give them a shot, we'll see. Now if we do look up here, we do have a Charizard, Pikachu, Dragonite, and a Mewtwo here. So I'm just gonna put this one over. I'm not gonna worry about those cards right now. All right, so here are our packs. So it does come with a card. Now I thought it was gonna be like a trading card, but really it's just a puzzle piece in these. So we'll just, you know, maybe for now, we'll see if they want to lean up against John Tavares here. Not well, so we'll see what we can do. Just leave that one like that. All right. Now, I thought there was a tab on these to pull them down. There's not. So let's just get going here. All right. So we can hear the cling cling of the medallion. So we do have the medallion there. The other ones I saw, all of them out of the box had the same exact same medallion. So we'll see. Here is about the Pikachu and the puzzle back. All right. So we do have a couple Sun and Moons actually, which is better than what I was expecting. So we do have a Sun and Moon pack and a sun and moon burning shadows so a couple different ones here i'm just going to try to hammer these ones out real quick i apologize for not having this done before hopefully i didn't do any damage to the tin nope tin's all good all right let's see what uh we get in here so it is not nine tails but we do are going to get the exact same one i'm not even sure who that is let's see the puzzle so Again, we have a Burning Shadows and just a base Sun and Moon. So we're going to get our 10 packs in here. Outside of that, we're going to hope for at least at least one EX or GX here. But from what I've been seeing in the openings, they aren't guaranteed. Oh, we did get a different one here. So there we go. So we did get a second coin. Coins probably have the most value out of these packs. Burning Shadows, Sun and Moon. Um, I did pick up a couple of these packs from our local Costco. So we'll see if it's worth opening up the other ones or not. Haven't quite decided yet. But we will uh, hammer this one out. And the worst part is I've been doing a good job of keeping the videos. All right, got another one of those. Um, a little on the shorter side, Burning Shadows, regular Sun and Moon, and then we're going to do this one where it's going to take me 10 minutes to open everything, so we'll see what we come up with here. Now, I don't know if this one's going to be the same or not, but I did see a guy and a third of that open up. When he was opening these up, there's a, a trick to a trick to opening these in order. So we're gonna go in Sun and Moon first, just the base ones here, because these will be a bit older. Oh, 
All right, so what did he do? He did one, one, two. That doesn't make sense. I don't know what he did. We'll see what happens on these. So we did, I'm just gonna hammer through these, show you if there's anything that we need to worry about. All right, we have a Dratini Hollow. Dratini Hollow. All right, and that was really the only thing in that pack. I was about to say that these open so much nicer than sports cards, or at least hockey cards have been for me. But then uh, I get one here that's not so much. Oh, I know what they did. One, two, three. Energy. Okay, there we go. That should be... So we have a hollow potion. And then an Inceroar, which is not shiny. So that should be, there we go, okay. So I hammer these out. Don't need to go through too much detail on these. We're just looking for the hits. We got a cute fly hollow, and that is it. So I know some packs have two hollows on them. Some packs only have one. It looks like we're getting the just the ones here. All right, so one, two, three, energy. Building dumbbells. The stage one Pokemon this card is attached to gets plus 40 HP. Interesting, I haven't seen that card before. Nothing too crazy through here. All right, we got an electric, or electric dot, or electros, sorry, hollow, and then a Persian base. All right, so nothing too exciting so far. Nothing too exciting at all. Let's see if we're lucky enough to get, and it looks like we do have something in this one. But we'll go through, we got Olivia, Kawhi, Porygon 2. I love how it's Porygon 2, just from Porygon. All right, and what is it we have? Okay, we have an Alolan Grimer. Oh, I forgot to get rid of the energy. And there we go, a Marshadow GX. Nice card there. Ability, Shadow Hunt. The Pokemon can use the attacks of any basic Pokemon in your card pile. You still need the necessity or necessary energy to attach. Interesting. All right, so we're just, you know, whenever you get a GX, we'll uh, GX, EX, VMAX, whatever it may be, we will throw those in there. Let's see if the Burning Shadows follow the same rules. So we're gonna go one, one, two, three, energy. Yep. All right, let's see what we get here. Hopefully we get another big hit on this pile. I'm not saying that the Marshadow is a big hit, but it is a hit. We have a Ribombi. And just the one card in this one. All right, let's just go one, two, three, energy. Another Meowth, Alolan v uh, Vulpex. And we have a Weevil Hollow. There we go. So we're down to our last three packs here, hoping for another X type card. <clears throat> but for the price point of these, I don't think you can go wrong. Another Rhydon. We've had quite a few Rhydons now. Noctowl, Mount Lenakilla, Energy. All right. Let's see if we can get the camera in focus here. Looks like we do have something here. So we have a, a Lycanric. So a Stage 1. And... Another GX, we have a Galissopod GX. There we go. So, 
not too bad. You know, two GX cards for this. Um, <clears throat> so I should say the, the value I got these cards at. Um, online, this box set goes for $75 retail. Costco sells them for $45. And Pinsir, Rare Candy, Bryon, and we have a Fighting Energy. And they were on sale, so I picked these up for the whole set for $35. So, again, just return of investment is not bad at all. Oranguru and a Sharpedo Reverse Hollow. There we go. So, let's see what's in our last pack here. What is in our last pack? Now, I want to see the back there. We'll see, I'll show you what it looks like here in a second. Oops. So we have one, two, three, energy. Oops, put those on the wrong pile. We got Grandpa, Metapod, and Team Skull Grunt. All right. Let's see what's in our last one here. We're not going to get anything crazy. We have a Pokemon Catcher Hollow and another Sharpedo Reverse Hollow. So, if I look at the back of this, we take these off. These cards that all came with it make up this little poster type. So, we can see that. So, all in all, for, for $35 plus tax, so I'm in Ontario, so it's 13% tax. You can't go wrong. We did get a nice set of hollows. We got a couple new coins. Now, they say metallic coins on them. I mean, they're plastic. But they do have shine, so I guess we're just going to call that metallic now. And we have a couple GXs. So a GX and a GX there, a Marsh Shadow. And our uh, Gullisopod, or Glissopod. So, awesome job. I appreciate everybody. If you haven't done so already, I mean, as you know, if you don't know, but we are doing a variety of content. We have some baseball, hockey, football, basketball, and Pokemon. So don't be afraid to hit that like button, subscribe, and leave a comment. Let me know what your favorite card from here was today, or if you have any suggestions for future videos. I just want to thank you for the support, and I will see you guys in the next one.